Hello, cousins. It is so great to be here. Uh, so for those who weren't here last year, I'm a writer, and uh, my upcoming book is about genealogy. And I got hooked on genealogy about three years ago. And part of what I find so exciting is that for the first time in history, we can now see how we're all related, how we are all cousins, and that Sister Sledge had their facts straight. We are family. And uh, this is partly due to the revolution in DNA. I took a DNA test and have found hundreds of new cousins, including, this was interesting, my wife. So uh, yeah, surprise. Uh, now, we're not first cousins. We're more like eighth cousins. And, and our kids are fine. They don't have two heads. Uh, I actually thought it was a cool fact, and it like was going to spice up our marriage. She was not so happy. She was kind of freaked out. But you can't please anyone, everyone. Now, uh, you can also find massive numbers of new cousins on online family trees, like Family Search and also Genie, which is a site where they have combined thousands of family trees into a single family tree, which just hit 100 million people. That's 100 million relatives all on a single family tree. It's mind-boggling. And I'm on this tree. Many of you are on this tree. Jennifer Aniston is on this tree. Barack Obama is on it. And you can see how you're related to all these people. Like Barack Obama is my fifth grade aunt's husband's brother's wife's seventh grade nephew. So <laughs> practically my older brother. And as research for the book I'm writing, I've been going, I went around the country and interviewed my cousins, cousin Daniel Radcliffe, cousin George Bush, and last year I sang with my cousins at the Mormon Tabernacle Choir. <laughs> I, I, thank you. I noticed I did not get invited back to sing this year, so there's some mix up in the emails, obviously, but I was so inspired by this idea that we're all related that I decided to celebrate by holding a party, throwing the global family reunion, the mother of all family reunions. And the idea was a family reunion mixed with a music festival, mixed with a celebration of family history. I invited all seven billion of my cousins to attend. Not all can make it. They were busy, but we did get 3,700 cousins at the festival in New York, which was held on the grounds of the World's Fair on June 6th. Plus, we had 40 simultaneous reunions all around the world in New Zealand, in Mexico, here in Salt Lake City. And those had over 10,000 cousins total. And I found the whole thing weird and fun and stressful and uplifting and exhausting. We had 58 speakers talking about family, Henry Louis Gates, uh, Ted Allen from the cooking show Chopped. We had a rabbi, a reverend, and an imam. That is not a joke. We actually did. We had tall cousins, short cousins, old cousins, young cousins, gluten-free cousins, carnivorous, carnivorous cousins. We just had, we had frisbee playing cousins, origami. We had the most delightfully random collection of C-list celebrities. It was like a 70s game show. There was Mary Lou Henner. There was David Blaine, the magician. And of course, we had Sister Sledge, who came and sang, we are family. So yeah, it was awesome. And to be honest, to be totally honest, it was only 75% of Sister Sledge, because three of the four sisters, uh, one of them apparently doesn't get along so well. So they're just like real family, you know? <laughs> we are dysfunctional family. Uh, now, we broke several world records, including biggest worldwide family reunion. One of the themes was to get people interested in family history. And luckily, we got wonderful media coverage of the Global Family Reunion. New York Times, Wall Street Journal, Good Morning America, People Magazine. It'll be featured in the season finale of Finding Your Roots this year on PBS. So I'm psyched. Um, personally, thanks. I, personally, I had a terrible time. Seriously, I was, <laughs> I was so stressed out that something would go wrong, like this drone that was taking pictures would smack into someone's head. It didn't. It all went smoothly. And that's thanks to the hundreds of people who helped me put it on, including many in this room. So thank you, Eowyn Langhoff. Thank you to uh, Pamela Weisberger, who sadly died a few months after the Global Family Reunion. 
We lost a great one with Pamela. She, uh, she once told me she was a descendant of one of the Three Stooges. But to me, she was funnier than all the Three Stooges put together, and Avid and Costello. Uh, we also had wonderful sponsors, including Family Search, of course, My Heritage, Find My Past, Genie, Wicketree, 23andMe, and Family Tree DNA. I am planning another global family reunion for 2017. And so you're all invited. Uh, because I believe in the message that we are all related. And it's not us versus them. It's just us. There is no them. We're in this together. You, me, Mary Lou Henner. So uh, as Henry Louis Gates said in his speech, despite our differences, we all come from the same ancestor. We are all cousins. So thank you, my cousins. Uh, hope to see you soon. And uh, can I borrow some money? Of course. All right. Thank you.